Hey everybody, it's Compelp. Thank you for watching this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to pick the RAM that you're going to buy to uh, insert into your computer. Alright, so my last video was on how to install RAM, but I didn't show you how to buy the RAM. And I've had a lot of questions on RAM lately. And I thought I'd show you how I bought my RAM, just so you guys don't do anything wrong. Or maybe buy too much RAM when you don't, ha when you don't, uh, your computer can't, you know, take that much on. Okay, so I'm just going to open up Mozilla Firefox here, my internet browser, and we're going to go to the tigerdirect.com. Direct.com. Okay, and I'll have the link to where I'm going in the description so you don't have to do this with me. I'm just going to type in RAM in the search bar, and you'll see Memory Finder. Okay, I'm just going to click Go Now. And you're just going to type in or uh, select your products, uh, product category, your manufacturer, product line, and model and such. So I have a notebook. I go by HP, which is Hewlett Packard. Product line is HP Pavilion Media Center. I have a Media Center edition uh, notebook or laptop. My model is the DV. 5030 I think let me see um, no it's gonna be over here there we go 5030 uh, US and there we go so we have a bunch of information here and it tells me about my computer right here now an important part to look at is right here max supported memory I can only insert two gigs alright so if I right click my computer you can see I can only support up to two gigs which I upgraded uh, with you guys, all right. So, anyway, don't buy more than what it says right here. Okay, some computers can only go up to half a gig. Some computers can go up to a gigabyte. Some can go up to like crazy amounts, all right. So, I mean, make sure you pay attention to this. All right. So now, all these pieces of RAM here, all these RAM sticks, are compatible with your computer, and it tells you a lot of information here. Who makes the, who makes it, the product name the part number, item number, and the price. Okay, so what I did is I actually didn't, I tried to spend as less as I can. So what I did is I went for the one gigabyte memory stick, which is 1,024 megabytes, all right? And I just, I don't know, I've never heard of this one. Maybe I have. But WinTech Industries, I just said, all right, any, mini miny, mo, you know, and, uh, yeah, Kingston is also really good, but they were more on the expensive side for me. So I just selected the $39.99, and I bought two sticks of this RAM right here. Sorry if I'm not making much sense right now. I'm pretty tired. Just got home from Las Vegas tonight. Anyway, so I picked uh, this WinTech one, and I bought it for $39.99. And, uh, yeah. All right, so an important tip when you're buying RAM, make sure... I would recommend, highly recommend, you not mixing RAM sticks. So let's say you have a Kingston already in your computer by default, and you're going to buy another stick. Make sure you buy a Kingston, and recommended buy two Kingston. You know, just don't even mix them. Um, I'm not sure if buying one Kingston, an older version versus a newer version, will do anything. But I would personally not take the chance. I just buy two brand new ones. All right. So in my case, I don't know which brand I had. But uh, I just bought two Wintech. So don't buy a Wintech and then a Kingston. Okay, buy two of whatever piece you're gonna get. That's what I recommend. Other people may have different opinions or whatever. But uh, yeah. Okay, so there you go. Now you can. What you can do is uh, you know what? P post this in the comment if you agree with this. I actually, I'm actually not completely sure on this, but I'm pretty sure you can buy. Let's say Kingston. 512 megabyte and a Kingston uh, 1 gigabyte. Although I don't know why you would want to do that unless your computer only supports 1.5 gigs of uh, RAM. But uh, yeah, I don't see why you wouldn't be able to do Kingston, two Kingstons, but different uh, memory sizes. Okay, so that's how you buy RAM. Remember again, I really recommend you buy just two brand new sticks um, from the same company. Alright, and that's how you do it through tigerdirect.com. Really neat. Uh, site here to to find out what kind of RAM. It's really easy to find what stuff you need, you know, and it just tells you all this information about your computer. Just 
I don't know, you just learn so much about your own computer. Alright guys, so thank you for watching this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. If this video has helped, if this video helped you at all. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I want you to check out a few websites, though. Check out my main website, comphelp.com. Check out my Twitter at twitter.com slash comphelp. And also check out how I make money online and how you can by going to detailsformoney.tk. All links will be in the description, as always. And, alright. So, thank you for watching the video, guys. Peace.